guys and welcome to game time my name is JJ and today we're gonna go back to do some more classic gaming we're gonna play some more Super Nintendo I picked out uh, Nosferatu by Seta Corporations today and you know it's hard to compete in the vampire world when you got games like Castlevania out there so we're gonna give this one a shot so join me as we go through Nosferatu he kidnaps your girlfriend and you're on a quest to get her back let's get at her all right, so let's get this started. I guess we'll go through the intro so everything is cool. When the moon is dyed in blood, a bat departs from a forbidden castle into the night. Having changed from its human form to seek its next victim. It's got a nice intro, like it's, it's not too bad so far. I'm only like 10 seconds in. Oh, look at that. Menacing vampire. The animation's not too bad. His name is whispered in fear. Nosferatu, creature of night. I'm scared. Few have seen his face and lived to speak of it. None who have ventured near his resting place have ever returned to tell of it. Every night transforming into bat, wolf, he seeks innocent blood. None know the victim's fate of the hose taken to the distant and forbidden castle. Except one who seeks to end the terror and rescue his love. Aw, oh, isn't that sweet makes his way to the accursed place. The animation's nice on the horse. Nosferatu. Alright, so... Well, let's see what's in the config here. A few difficulty levels, not too, too much. Not too much to change for buttons or... Not much for options. We'll leave it on normal. Alright, let's start this bad boy. Oh, and we're running towards the castle. Kind of like Castlevania. Alright, so it drops us into the dungeon here. The, whoa. Controls are bad. It's really, really stiff. Hard to turn around and stuff. I guess we'll push this over. We'll see what we're going at. Oh, we got some enemies. Oh, oh. oh man. The controls are horrible. Alright, well, I guess we'll keep punching this guy in the face. Really? Oh. Wow, the jumping's horrible. Oh, come on, get up here. Oh, really? All right. Walks very, very, very slow. Now, how do I get down here? Come on. Huh. Oh. Horrible. Come on. Like, how do you walk around like that? Like, how am I supposed to get that item? without getting hit. Stupid caterpillar. Oh, how much, like you can't even kick downwards. Come on. There's supposed to be a bunch of different moves and stuff like that, but I, I, it's so hard to figure out since the controls are so bad. I'm just gonna keep punching these guys in the face. Ugh. So throughout the game you collect uh, different colored crystals and they give you different types of abilities like red crystals if you collect three will increase your your power and give you special stuff and blue crystals will increase your life permanently and green crystals I'm not quite sure yet I'm figuring that out as I go all right so we're finally into a new room let's keep going to the right here Oh man. Really? 
Now how do I get down through here? Come on. Oh, oh. Come on. There's got to be a way to crawl or slide or something. Come on. So I've been doing this for my whole timer. Like, look, man, my timer's going to run out. Come on, just let me figure out how to get under here. Nope. So my first game over. That's bullshit, man. Let the timer run out. <laughs> game over. Alright, so we start this bad boy over and we'll get back to where... <laughs> See if we can figure out how to get under that little pathway there. Come on. Oh, the controls are so bad. Come on, get up there! Oh, We'll just hang here while we get this. Finally figured this out. Stupid worm. We'll get across. Make our way back to where we were. Alright. Come on. Maybe if I get a running start. Come on! Ugh! Like, who's stupid enough to let himself freaking run into a wall like that? Come on! Just let me get through here! So horrible. I'm getting freaking annoyed with this man. Oh! Alright. I'm pretty happy about this. I get to go a little bit further. Come on, come on. Oh, what the hell, man? As if one hit makes you die. And it starts you back at the beginning. All right, so here we go again. Go under here. Hopefully make it a little bit further this time. This thing's very. This game's very ruthless with horrible controls. You're not going to get very... You're going to die a lot. Oh, we'll grab ourselves a little treasure chest. I have no idea what that thing does, but we'll go up the stairs. Alright. What's going to kill us now? Take that, you freaking werewolf. Ugh, punch you in the face. Oh, I'd rather be playing Prince of Persia on the old freaking computer. At least we'll grab ourselves another treasure, another... What the? How, oh, how do you dodge it? How do you dodge it? I don't even know if I can kill half this stuff. Everything's out to kill ya. Oh. oh. Oh, Frankenstein. He's going to punch you in the face. Oh. Come here. Oh. Take that, Frankenstein. Oh. Punch you in the back. What? He just disappeared. I didn't even get to finish him off. Alright, see how many times it takes me to slide under this one. Come on, come on. Oh, first try. Oh. Alright. Well, I guess I can't go through this gate. I guess I'm going up. No, that, that opens the door, but I'm still curious. Let's see what's up here. Oh. What's over here? We got a doorway. Yeah, but I'm curious at what's at the bottom. So let's go check out what's down there. Very slow paced game, man. It's like a chore. Something you want to avoid. Oh, what the fuck was that? Do you see that? I'm like a, it's like an arm and like a puddle. That was crazy, man. Like I'm, 
I'm not even going back up there. That freaked me right out. I'm out of here. Oh. I'd rather deal with these guys and deal with that killer puddle. Alright, found some more stairs. Let's go up. Like, the graphics are nice and stuff in the game. The animation is nice on the enemies and stuff, but it's just... It's too slow. It makes you wish you had a whip. And grab me a few little crystals here. Like, the backgrounds are nice and stuff. But look at how he walks. He's like It's like he has a broomstick stuff up his ass. So we got the wolf man here, and we're going to punch him in the face a few times. Holy shit. We got some killer friggin' blade. He's going to throw. We're just going to keep ducking to dodge that. Come on. Oh. So unresponsive, man. Come on. Come here. Come here. Oh, uppercut. Oh. It's so hard to dodge enemy attacks. Oh, he transformed. What the fuck? Oh. He just totally destroyed me. Just grabbed me with the face and pummeled me. Let's try this again. Come on. Oh, kick you. Oh, look, he kills me again. They make stuff very difficult, man. Like, come on. Come here, you. Oh. Okay. Anyways, you get to level 2, and it's more craziness, man. Just like, the, what the? Is this a beholder? This giant flying eyeball. I can't even hit him, man. Come on. Come here. Oh. I, got, I just started the level, and I'm dead. The levels don't get any easier, either. You're constantly getting bombarded with swords and blades and rooms that you, you can, can't possibly make it through without getting hit like stuff like this where there's this blade constantly bombarding you like this is bullshit like I gotta slide underneath there and get into the next room like how am I supposed to do this Ugh. like you know look 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 how much health I have left after doing that like it's insane like how am I supposed to know there's spikes that are gonna be there right in front of your face Ugh. you know it's full of it's full of stuff that you just you don't have a choice to get hit. Like how am I supposed to dodge that trident? Like I have to jump down here. Like Like look at this guy here. Like how am I supposed to dodge what he's gonna throw? No, I can't, because I can't get to the damn bastard. Oh. Anyways, that's enough ranting. We're gonna at least try to get over here and do something productive, because man oh, there you go. I'm dead. Ah, <sighs> all right. So the levels, like I said, don't get any easier. You're constantly like stuff happens everywhere. Like, what am I fighting? I don't even know, but I'm getting my ass handed to me. Get over here! Like, what are these guys, man? They take like a million hits. You don't get any weapons, and the special moves that you get to do, you can't even pull them off. Like, I'm surprised I can pull off that kick. All right. So I'll keep going up. Come on. Get up there. Now we got fire. Alright. We'll... Oh, I'm dead. Damn werewolves. I'm not even bothering. Come on. So we fight the golem, dude. Oh, look at this guy. Ugh. Come on. Ruthless. Get. Come here. Uh, uh, uh. So hard to dodge. Come here. Get a little bit closer. Oh, horrible. Oh, he just totally punches me in the face. That's not cool. Get. How am I supposed to get close to him? Come here. This game's hardcore, man. Oh. Come here. Oh, I so wish I had a weapon. Oh, what the? He just transforms into a big foot. Like, do you think that 
there'd be something else that he would transform to instead of a big foot. Like, who, who decided for it to be a big foot? Come here! Oh, he's gonna so fuck me up. Oh! So once you get to the end of the game, it's just enemies everywhere. Spike's killing you everywhere. Like, you, you're not, you, you can't even stop for a minute. Like, look how many hits it takes these guys to go down. Come here. Oh, oh, oh. And they just keep coming back. Come here. Oh. Like, how many hits is it going to take? Holy. Come on. Come on. Oh, now I got to slide with these guys here? Oh, that's bullshit, man. Come here. Oh, come on. Oh, I thought I can sneak in there. Oh, the controls are so bad in these narrow passageways. Get out of my face! That's horrible, man. Like, that's totally horrible. So you get to the end of the game and you got this Dracula looking dude, or sorry, Nosferatu, and he's a bastard. Like, you know what? His health just doesn't want to go down. Totally destroys you. Like, oh. Like, every time he, he just floats around the room like you wouldn't believe. Come here. Come here! Oh, I'll kick you in the face. Get down here. Oh, now he's changing into a bat. Come here. Oh, you gotta jump and kick him, I guess. Get in my range, you bat. Very hard. Like, how are you supposed to do this? You're gonna have. You'd have to be a vampire killer master ninja to do this. Like, it'd be better if they actually gave you items and stuff. But man, just getting close to the enemy. Come here. Getting hit markers is tough too. You just get oh, he just grabs you. Come on! Totally annihilates you. Come here, come here! Let me punch you in the face at least one more time before you kill me. Screw this game. I'm tired of playing this. I'm going to play Castlevania. Play something good. So that was Nosferatu for the Super Nintendo. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please like, subscribe, and comment. I'll have some more classic gaming goodness in future episodes. And Nicholas St. Jean, you are the winner of my sealed Final Fantasy VIII game from my contest that I was holding. So get a hold of me on Facebook and I will deliver your game to you, buddy. Congratulations. And I will catch you guys all on the next episode of Game Time. Peace and happy gaming.